the macro world, a world within our own world. So much would seem alien to us within the macro world, with every object having its own characteristics, unmistakable to the last. Everyday things that seem simple and passive reveal a much bigger importance in the macro world. Space, not even worthy of our eyes' attention for more than a second, become coliseums in the macro world. Considerably perfect things in our world reveal their imperfections in the macro world, while our imperfections become blatant obstacles in the macro world. What exactly are the rules of the macro world? While what we call visible light is very important for us to determine complex shapes, how important is that in the macro world? Surrounded by nothing but objects that tower you, objects the size of humans become incomprehensible in the macro world, not to mention the size of our Earth. What is the speed of life in the macro world? Being that an ant can naturally move as fast as 40 times its own body length in a second, something we can only relate to when using automotive transportation. How terrifying is it to be trapped on a rainy day in the macro world, with only a few drops of water equaling to that of a tsunami? What qualifies as existence in the macro world? As demonstrated here, my camera sits literal millimeters from this potential queen ant to be, and it's as if she has no idea that the hulking size of my camera is a potential threat to her life. The macro world is very curious. Probably most curious is that our world wouldn't exist without it. But how often do you stop to think about the macro world? Remember to always feed your curiosity.